on ibuprofen and Dayquil right now and some Fit Aid. All right, sweet. <laughs> Do I need to hit play? Or is no, it already it's already gone. Oh, perfect. It's already gone. We got all that B roll right there. So, all right, is that thing's already planned? Here we go. Hey, welcome to the first ever Sciota Surf Report at CrossFit Sciota. Uh, the surf today is low, very low, and not variable. Okay, it's just flat. All right, Jess, what do we got today? Um, we're going to talk a little bit about Sciota's history. Tell me a little bit about it. All right, you know, the, the history of Sciota, we just had our sixth anniversary, our sixth birthday party a couple weeks ago, and, you know, so you can go back, started in, uh, the idea started in about June of 2013. I was coaching at another gym in Columbus and um, was looking to, to uh, open something, and so I uh, looked uh, in the Worthington and Dublin area at the time, but somehow ended up down here in Grandview. And uh, we basically opened up in the July time frame, spent about a month cleaning out the space on 3rd Avenue, building it up, and then um, uh, opened that. Opened it and on, we'll say, July 15th. We did two weeks of free trials to get some people interested in, in it. And then uh, we officially opened uh, August 1st of 2013. It's been a great uh, six years so far. We've obviously gone through some ebbs and flows. Um, and uh, just recently, you know, uh, a year ago in May of 2018, uh, moved, in, moved over to this facility. So um, 1066 Ridge Street here at what I call the gateway of Grandview, right? You know, you get off of 670 right here. You go right into the, the Grandview crossing area the Grandview Dublin Road area and go right up the hill into Grandview. Uh, we're about 1.6 miles away from our Third Avenue facility, you know, which is still a, a Buckeye Strength and Performance facility. It's the Strength Lab. And so that, that facility has 24 hour, seven day a week um, access, um, separate membership, um, does have our Olympic weightlifting classes over there. But, uh, you know, the uh, 1066 Ridge Street is uh, our CrossFit facility. So nine classes a day. Um, and uh, yeah, you know, great little facility um, for for the the average CrossFitter, you know, the 95 percenter. And so we really enjoy uh, the programming. We're following Invitkus programming, which we've gone through some some iterations of programming uh, with with uh, coaches writing it and different things like that. But now we've been following Invitkus for um, six months now, and people seem to really really like it. Awesome. Tell me a little bit about what surfers. So, you know, we talk about this is the Sciota Surf Report, and if you've been around Columbus for any length of time, uh, I'll try to float in a little logo up here or something like that. But, uh, you know, there was, a, there, was a, there was an organization called Surf Ohio. And obviously, if you think about it, we're Ohio, we're landlocked. Um, you're not really going to do any surfing in Ohio. So it was kind of a parody um, on, on surfing in, in the Midwest. and. Uh, you know, uh, in the, the 80s and 90s, they came out with the, uh, a joke. They printed up a bunch of t-shirts that were the, the Olentangy Classic, you know, surfing down the Olentangy River. Uh, obviously, that's not going to happen, but, you know, the Sciota, um, our names, CrossFit Sciota, Sciota is a river. It's an Indian name, meaning Great River. And uh, so the, the joke was, we're the Sciota surfers. And, uh, you know, every every team has to have a mascot and so the surfers are the side of mascot nice awesome yeah so a little bit of history and uh, that's episode one of the side of surf report flat surf today not a good surf day have a great day take care see ya